the One Piece live action. We're all putting our heart and passion into this. We're gonna need a real pirate ship worthy of the Straw Hat crew. Oda Sensei has infinite ideas making the manga still so popular after so many years. It's such an expansive world that people are absolutely die hard for. Getting a chance to bring that story to life, it's absolutely amazing. Matt, the showrunner, he's a super fan. Who better to make an adaptation than a super fan? Action. I've been a massive fan of One Piece for years and years. Having a built-in fan base is a phenomenal thing, and that also comes with a lot of responsibility to get it right. With every aspect of this, we use the manga created by Oda Sensei, his designs that's always our North Star. The series has been running for 25 years, and we know a lot about these characters and about the world, so it's given us the opportunity to throw in a lot of Easter eggs for fans. Let's go! Right! It's a really tricky balancing act, trying to figure out what you're going to put in and what you're going to leave out. The hardest part was finding the right story arcs and emotional arcs for characters that would make for a wonderful season of television. I don't want to be a Marine. I'm a pirate! And a big challenge was figuring out how to include backstory. These backstories are all in the manga, and we made a decision early on to parcel it out and tie it into present-day story. We went by Oda-san's SBS chapter notes, where he answers fan questions at the end of chapters in the manga. It's full of character backstories and birth dates and heights. These are so good! Their favorite foods and things like that. So we scoured those and thought that brought a lot of wonderful emotional grounding with the characters. What's been really great is Oda Sensei and his team have been with us the entire time. Getting to talk with him is one of my favorite experiences about this. And that collaboration, I think, has birthed something really special. Hey, Zoro, what are you going to wear? Something black. The most challenging thing translating the page to the screen was bringing the color and the life into our characters without it looking like a cosplay. The manga's black and white, and so Oda's color walk became our Bible. Color Walk gave us a very unique opportunity to see the Straw Hat characters in different environments, in different costumes. It gave me the opportunity to introduce texture and tailoring without in any way compromising the look of the manga. Our costume design is absolutely incredible. We have a lot of nods to things ultimate fans would know. One of the things that we thought would make the show feel more real is if we did as much as we could in camera. It was a conscious choice to use prosthetics as much as possible, particularly on the Fishman. With prosthetics, one of the trickiest things was to try and keep all the designs as close as possible to honor Mr. Oda's work and then bring something to screen that looks like it could live in the real world. It's trying to find the middle ground between both of the mediums. And when we do have an idea to tweak or change something, it's always a conversation with Oda Sensei and his team. Snail phone being a perfect example, we did snail phones that you have in the manga. And then the prop crew came up with tiny snail phones that fit in your ear like a Bluetooth. Props then designed a snail megaphone that amplifies the voice across the water. Lower your sails and submit to my authority. The attention to detail that everyone has and just the talent of our individual departments. It's incredible. I think we were really successful in being able to bring One Piece into a new medium and show just how special it is and why so many people all over the world love this series so much. To the best crew sailing on the sea and to our victory! It's been a pleasure to be a part of this journey. It's such a creative world, so many interesting characters. I was truly overwhelmed when I saw it and I can't wait for the fans to see it too. You're my Captain Luffy from now until the end. The spirit of One Piece is so strong in this. It is such a privilege to work on this show. There's something really wonderful in what Otisan has created. Truly, this is his sandbox and we're just playing in it. Next up, the Grand Line!